YouTubers, it's Mark from Truth Seeker, and I'm in Soul 513, and I just want to show you this. I mean, uh, to me, I find this very, uh, I don't know, just weird. I found it to be very, very, just interesting. I mean, just look at this thing. It looks like it's got a face with two eyes, lips. It's laying down, right? Then it looks to be like there's something else carved back down here. We come back here, there's another strange item. Here you can see they just did some blurring. I mean, nothing really new. But, uh, a lot of little strange things in this area, but this just really stands out. And then they blurred this area right here. This, see how this has got a perfect arch to it? They blurred all of that out. But this was left. And it looks like it has two perfect eyes. Lips. I mean, what are the chances? Then you come back to this item here. even even stranger I mean look they blurred so they put like a blood I don't know if they added that black smudge you can just see they, they just blurred they just went crazy with the blurring on that too Then we come back into this area and just look at the way they pixelated everything. But there's structure back. I mean, look at this piece. And these circles, another circle, circle, circle. Then it comes into this item. It's got a white insert out looks like piping it's got some pipe coming out of it you can see here it looks like almost a statue that was coming up that they blurred here's a perfect example of ghosting Okay, what they, you get to see where they erased it. There was a statue sitting right there. There's another one coming up right here. Look at this piece. It comes up. It's got like some type of uh, circular pattern. That's how they block this whole... This whole area here is heavily, they moved just, all the pixels are moved around. And this looks like the head of uh, a statue. Look at this down here. It don't even match. See along here where they cut the picture? See, this is the stuff that I want NASA to have to answer for. And I just don't understand. I mean, I know somebody was going to sue NASA, you know, over not reacting and, you know, investigating these anomalies. And then, you know, that just kind of disappeared and died out, you know. I just don't understand how they could get away with this. I just, I have no clue. I'm actually speechless. I mean, they let some things through. Other things, they go through all this trouble to block. I mean, it's, it's just so confusing when you really think of it. And look at this. It comes up. It's a perfect head. There's one eye. There's the other eye. I mean, it's all types. Look at this. It comes up. I mean, this looks... This here, to me, looks like just like a gravestone. Like a carved out gravestone that you would see walking through any cemetery here. There's another carving right next to it. Yeah. 
I mean, this this stuff is here. I mean, it's uh, granted they're moving pixels around. And, you know, they're taking a pixel, moving it up five over three. You know, it's like putting a puzzle together. I mean, when you look at these pictures, you, you really have to think out of the box. It's like this. See how this is hidden? See what, how they blurred it? You could see it's, it's a metallic in nature. It's on a base. But this is where they cut the pixels off, right here. Now you have to search the picture in this vicinity to try to find those pixels. You know, it's, it's very frustrating. Because when NASA edits these pictures, there's n almost no rhyme or reason to what they're doing. I guess it's good in a way for them. Because they don't stick by any certain uh, protocol when it comes to editing. I mean, it's just, you know, I guess all hands on deck and you do whatever you want to do, you know. You use whatever, I guess, you know, I, I believe most of it is done by computer. But, you know, there's got to be human touch-ups in it. I mean, look at this stuff. See how this comes up? It's a little carving. Here is, they just blurred out. Look at this, another little carving. There's the eye and mouth. I mean, look at all this stuff. Look at what they did here. I mean, they just... I mean, it's as clear as day to me. Look at this perfect, just a perfect uh, arch. Look at it. And you can see there's little carvings. Here's here's a carving that's on a little base. I mean, hey, yeah, you know. I mean, look at this. Look at this block right in the center here. They just This doesn't even match. It's just not even right. It looks like they put a black... This was all a black smudge right here covering this up. But it just so happens it's right next to this perfect... Pyramid. This is a very good saw. 513. I'll give you the links as usual. This is one of those pictures I, you know, you download it, uh, you know, bring the contrast up a little, the brightness down, and uh, then drop down the saturation. And, you know, go through it. I guarantee you're going to find probably at least 10 things that I haven't found. So, look at this. See how this has got a perfect top to it. See how they cut it off? I blurred all this out. But look at it. It looks like a perfect platform with something laying on it. And this strange stuff back here and more. I mean, like I've been saying from the beginning, a lot of this to me is gravestones grave markers. Look at the carving that's in here. Look at either this is a skull that's embedded into here. Let's see what I let's see what I could do. this in here. I mean, it looks like there's an eye here, and then here. Looks like there's some type of chain. And you'd see the links. I mean, this looks like 
a skull of some sort or carving but this is all added all it is black it's just too black just you could just see where they added it it's just and then down here they just blended it just a little they brought it to the background brought these little pieces to the front but you could just see I mean it's you could just see where they added it all right guys I think that's about it I mean I don't, I don't really see anything I mean there's a couple of carvings here and stuff but there's just stuff everywhere I mean you could spend four or five hours on this picture just alone but as usual I'll give you guys the links and uh, you know I'll see you uh, to seekers see you next time thanks guys two seekers out